We are here with the king of Genesis. Oh, yes. The Neo Geo avatar. I'm guilty. The champion of games. Thank you. I know. Thank you. You're flattering me. Keith Apicary. Sir, it's an honor. Oh, it's an honor to be here. Thank you. Now, what happened at E3? Oh, jeez. E3 is always crazy when I go there because, you know, I get in trouble, but whatever. I'm just trying to have fun and just trying to, you know, do something exciting, I guess, or mm -hmm. getting a little too crazy because there's always new games coming out and I get excited. So things happen. But this year, I got in trouble. I actually got in trouble this time. I usually get away just narrowly, but I was looking for what everyone was looking for for the past 15 years. It's supposed to come out. Everyone knows it's going to come out and it's a big secret. But I had a feeling this year was the year they're going to have a Dreamcast 2. So I was on a search for it, and I, I thought I went to a reliable source, a video game TV channel. I thought they would have the information, but apparently they don't know anything about video games. So they had no idea what, what, what to do besides kick me out. Mm -hmm. So yeah, I went on G4 and asked Olivia Mine. I thought she was like the spokesperson for video games, and she didn't know anything about the Dreamcast 2. So, <laughs> oh well, I just got kicked out. So maybe next year. Maybe next year? Maybe next year I'll find out, yeah. What if they do announce it? Are you going to do, do it no matter what? Are my you gonna brain be will there? explode, so I won't be there. I'll be dead. <laughs> so i got to like get ready and, and like imagine that it's real now so I can almost explode. And then when I tell them, I'm like, oh, yeah, I knew about that for a while now. You know, I did a behind the scenes, and I saw a little new new virtual boy. Oh, you did? No, it's called uh, the 3DS. Oh, but isn't yeah, yeah, I know that. That is cool. I think I feel that it's like 3D. I just wish... I really wish they would do it. I know they won't because it's like no one would want it and everyone complains about the Virtual Boy. But I think it's really cool. I think someone should invent some type of a virtual reality device. Cause this, I think having something on your face is like really cool. Like the 80s movies, it's like that was just, that was the next thing and no one really did it except for Virtual Boy. And then you know about well, Virtual Boy, I just wish someone could do it right. So I think if they took the technology for 3DS and put it and like surrounded your face, it would be pretty legit. So maybe they could combine the two. Someone will probably modify one, put it on your face. I'll buy that. Rock on. Off dude. eBay or something. Rock on. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, and uh, you're going to be releasing a music CD with all your, your classic songs? I, I think I will be. I think I'm going to, I might release like a special DVD. Because mm -hmm. like I got three more songs I'm working on right now. I'm working on a, a Sonic song called Sonic the Hedge song. And then I'm working on a Virtual Boy song. And then a Dreamcast. It might be Dreamcast 2 song. Like my... I express how I express how I want the thing to come out so badly. Those are the three songs I'm working on right now, and those songs will be on iTunes before the music videos are out. So I figure I'll get the songs out so people know them, then do the music videos. So then I might do a DVD of just music videos or a CD of the songs. So yeah, once I get enough songs, I'll put them all together. You know, there's going to be a Sonic Con. There is. You? I did not know that. Yes. When is that happening? Next week. Where is that? It's uh, not that far from here. Is it in Texas? It's all about Sonic. Really? Yes. That's very, very interesting information you give me. I don't know if I'll be able to be there, unfortunately. But maybe next year I can extend my stay. Exactly. Do they do it every year? First year. We'll see how it works. Oh, really? Okay. But Are you, you next year could be the champion of that oh, event. Oh, that would be really awesome. That could be your event, sir. I think it could be. I mean, I know it is. <laughs> it's just I'm not there this year. I won't be. Or maybe, maybe where you're at, you can do a Knuckles event. Oh, that'd be cool. A knuckle that'd be con. really cool, yeah. I guess being me and a bunch of guys punching some walls and stuff. Exactly. That'd be cool. That's right. the way you think. Well, Mr. Apicary. Yes. It's always my pleasure. Oh, thank you. You did the podcast for me. One of the best yes. podcasts. Yes, that was a good podcast. So, yes. thank you once again, Keith Apicary. You can always see Thank you for having me again. On We're old friends now. <laughs> yes, we are. Yeah. And you can see all of his stuff on ScrewAttack.com. Yes. He is the man. Thank, Thank you, you, sir. Thank you. Good talking to you again. Good talking to you. Oh, gee.